Her transformation into Theranos founder Elizabeth Holmes. This is an inspiring, an inspiring step forward. Is being called triumphant and fascinating to watch. Just one drop of blood and we can change the world. But before I could even fangirl over Amanda Seyfried and Hulu's The Dropout. I can't give them one reason to doubt me. The Oscar nominee had a total fangirl moment with me. You know what? Oh I'm gonna take some of your time away because <laughs> nobody go. told me that I'd be meeting you. They did? <sighs> they did not tell me. Hold on a second. Just give me a second. Sorry. I'm sorry. It can't help it. I'm just a big fan. I'm just, there's certain people. I love you. Thank you so much. That means a lot. I, I think you're you. wonderful. I just really always agree with you all the time. Oh my gosh. Maybe one day we'll meet in person. We will. We're in this circle now. Yeah. We're, we're gonna do it. This isn't just my job. This is who I am. I actually read this in an article, how even though you did all this research, that you still feel like you don't know her. Okay, so she's an enigma. Like she is, sometimes I wonder if she knows herself. I'm sure she does. But sometimes I wonder. It's amazing how she can be so evasive, so beautifully evasive, and bring so many people in. That was one of the reasons I wanted to play her, but also mm. it, it gave me a lot of freedom because I was really taking from everything I'd seen that taught me nothing about her. And leaning on everything that Liz Merriweather wrote in the show. So I was taking a lot of the imagined reality and and then and then everything that I learned from all of the footage I have, the deposition tapes, there's 10 hours, nine hours of deposition tapes. There's you know, the Maria Shriver interviews and, and the 2020, the Dateline, you know, all, of course the documentary, I can just go on forever getting mannerisms and getting, and getting insight into how she spoke to, to people publicly, but the private Elizabeth Holmes is nowhere to be seen. There's so much we don't know, and for a reason, and let's turn it around and try to imagine what she might have been thinking, because that's what people want to know. How does someone get from here to there? And, and what are they really thinking? Yeah. Amanda learned everything she could about the Stanford dropout. There was just so much studying. It was like, I, I am not an academic. I never went to college. And for the first time in my life, and I had two kids at this point, I was like, I just can't wait to study. Anytime they went down for a nap, I would open my, I bought a laptop just for this. And I would like watch the deposition tapes and then like write things down. To become the woman who scammed investors out of billions. Do you imagine a portable blood testing device on the battlefield? Convincing them her revolutionary device worked with just a single drop of blood. This technology is 10 years away. Lost Naveen Andrews plays Theranos' COO, Sonny Balwani who was also Elizabeth's then boyfriend. Naveen, with you, and, and as you, you're portraying these real life characters, do you think that your role with Sonny, in any way do you think that his role in this scandal was as severe as hers? That's a very good question. <sighs> as severe, and, and what's the criteria for yeah. severity? You know, yeah. it's like, I mean, I, I, I took it at a very basic level. Um, as perhaps a, a simplistic level, which is the depth of his love for her. I mean, he, to me, he seemed besotted with her, and I think he still is, even after what happened at the trial. What do you think she would say about you playing her? You know, if she were to watch it, I think if I were her, I would be slightly grateful that we took the time to explore the context. I think. It's the one thing being very, very public. A lot of things are one-sided. People believe what they want to believe about you with the information that they have. It's just, that's, a, that's, a, that's a, a disadvantage to being in the public eye. And uh, every single human being is complex and is nuanced. And, you know, we gave another perspective. And this perspective that, especially in the beginning, was very compassionate to her beginnings. The Dropout is streaming now. Thank you for watching. If you want more extra, hit the subscribe button and the bell so you'll never miss a video.